You know to salt your food, but have you ever thought about salting your drinks? It's not just for margaritas anymore. Many bartenders swear by a dash of saline in all sorts of drinks to really elevate them. But why? Let's have a look at the science behind it and then I'll put it to the test by making two daiquiris, one with salt and one without, and we can see what kind of difference it makes. So the underlying reason for this phenomenon is that we as humans crave salt because we need it to survive. To us, it has flavor enhancing qualities. We can perceive five tastes, so sweet, sour, bitter, salt, and umami. Every good cocktail relies on an interplay between these and for them to be quite harmonious. In small quantities, salt doesn't make things salty, but it does interfere with our experience of the other tastes. Firstly, salt increases our perception of sweetness by diminishing our ability to taste bitterness. And then it also interacts with water in a way that makes it easier for volatile molecules to launch themselves in the air, which is a rather violent sounding way of just saying that it heightens aromas. These qualities combined can mean essentially that salt makes things taste like the best version of themselves. It also adds a bit of texture and mouthfeel, which can help round out stiffer drinks and make them taste less harsh. The easiest way to add salt to cocktails is by making up a little saline solution like this. So you're just dissolving salt in water at a certain percentage, depending on your desired effect. And then you just dash it into your drink as you would with bitters. You could also salt your sugar syrup. So somewhere around 1% of salt to sugar in it works well or just layer it in with homemade ingredients. So um, I often add just pinches of salt to syrups and so on the same way that you'd, you would while you're cooking. So I'm gonna make two really classic daiquiris here. I'm actually gonna make them in the same tin so they are the same drink, but then I'll pour one out and then add a dash of saline solution to the other and we'll see what kind of difference it makes if I can tell. So we're gonna go 60 mils of rum, per drink that is, so two ounces total. I guess I could have done a smaller version of it given that we were just trying it, but oh well, we're here now. 30 mils or one ounce of fresh lime, and then 15 mils uh, or half an ounce of sugar syrup. Obviously just chose the daiquiri because it's a really good control drink. It's so simple, um, you know, everyone kind of knows what it's supposed to taste like. So sometimes when you are playing around with these kind of things, just something, yeah, that's very kind of straight down the line classic um, is a good one to use. my identical uh, glasses here as well, because obviously we're, we're super scientific here behind the bar. So that's one out, and then I'm just gonna add two dashes of my little saline solution. I'll actually have to double check exactly what percentage we did this one to, but I'll pop it in the description. Give it a quick other shake up. Right, so we'll go with the classic. Bright, fresh, limey. Um, you definitely got quite a lot of sourness there. Uh, obviously the rum, you know, kind of comes through underneath. Very good classic daiquiri, if I do say so myself. And then it definitely does taste a little bit sweeter with the salt, the, um, the lime isn't quite as jaggy right at the end there, so it feels a bit more, I guess, harmonious, a bit more of like a continuous sort of flavor all throughout. And it does just feel a little bit uh, richer, like I feel like I can really kind of get the, the rum coming through as the base there a little bit more. And it just does sit like a little, yeah, a little bit heavier on the palate. Like it, it does feel almost more like I've used a bit more sugar or, or like a liqueur or something that would just give it a bit of a weightier texture than the other one. So yeah, it's, uh, it's not bullshit apparently. So give it a go.
So the next time your cocktail needs a little je ne sais quoi, it could be as simple as a pinch of salt. Definitely let me know if it's something that you've played around with before or plan on now. Salt and cocktails, so now you know.